Jake before surgery. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. We recorded guitars at Matt Shorter's house in Kiwana. It was like being at a mate's house and hanging out and recording guitars, so it was, it was easier to stay focused because everybody was really relaxed. The last couple of times we recorded a CD was really far from home. Like, we were in Sydney last time, sleeping in a tent while we weren't at the studio, and it was really icky, dirty. dirty. And yeah, so it was really cool to just be able to finish work and drive five minutes and jump straight into recording guitars. Um, the guitar we use for the guitar is, is a custom shop um, by Carvin. The seven string has um, got bare knuckle aftermath pickups in it, which are uh, not a very high gain sort of pickup, but like mid range sort of, which is cool what we want for the new stuff. It's not really like the heaviest thing, I'm not trying to do the heaviest band here. Yeah, it'll make a good sound. We recorded all the leads on Mitch's Fender Telecaster to Jim Root as EMG pickups. I'm a big fan of the neck one and on a maple neck, it just sounds so nice recording leads. It was a real pleasure recording to Chaz's drumming. He, he's grown so much in the last couple of years and I know that he's been waiting and waiting for us to record so that he can show everybody else just how, how far he's come. It makes things so much easier for me and Jake as writers when we have a drummer like him. Whenever he brings his touch to the songs, it makes us so much more excited about our own music. It's cool. <laughs> the writing process was a lot different than last time. I was in a, going through a very transitional time of my life, going from somebody who I'd wasn't really sure I was into learning more about my surroundings and about the kind of world we live in and it really changed the way I saw everything and it also changed the music I wrote. I dug deeper into my heart and, and it definitely helped music writing a lot. It was also different in the way that the last album we did, Hollow Thoughts of a Nameless Man, was five songs written by Jake and five songs written by me. And on this CD, it was it was five songs that I'd written while we were just while me, Chaz, and Jake were living together, and we really wanted to put these out, then continue to sort of move in a new direction as a band. So I guess it's kind of like a teaser for the future. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>